I mean, fool me once and all that, but don't worry, you're not going to be able to fool me twice because I'm a geek. Sorry, sir, I'm just I'm super pumped because I've used my complete and total badass reigness to bust a move through layers of local legal bureaucracy. And I have learned that Sarah Young, a street prostitute in St. Paul, say that five times fast, was murdered last year. Mm, I bet she was strangled during a rendezvous. Mm. Two other prostitutes, both strangled with nylon rope, turned up eight and 15 years ago, one in Iowa City, the other in rural Illinois. The new crossing state lines which make it more difficult to link the crimes. It's a very different cooling off period. I wonder what was so special about those dates. First kills were in 2000, 2007, and then he went dormant till last year. What triggers him? Death in the family? He could keep losing jobs. These are sex crimes, so what interferes with sex drive? Children. The addition will help disrupt even the happiest of couples. More specifically, the births. What if each of these kills corresponds to the births of the unsub's own children? Garcia, how many men in the hunting zone had a child in 2000? Diaper. Pampers Cruisers with three-way fit. They adapt at the waist, legs, and bottom. With up to 12 hours of protection for all the freedom to move their way in Pampers Cruisers. Only Pampers diapers are the number one choice of hospitals, nurses, and parents. Yeah. <laughs> 